After experiencing the immense energy of Kedarnath, I went to another powerful temple, Gupta Kashi, the secret Kashi. Namaskar. I am Nirmal Purani, an Isha meditator since the last four years. Here is my spiritual journey and experience when I travel to few of the most powerful spaces of the Himalayas. This yatra was not just about what I got from the mountains. It was also about what I lost to the Himalayas. The temple is located at a height, and we have to go through this narrow lane with a considerable climb to reach there. This lane has small shops on its both sides, and thousands of pipes running all across the steps. Soon we reached the temple. Entering a temple which is said to be established and consecrated by Agastya Muni himself was a different feeling altogether. The temple has a kund in front of it named Manikarnika Kund, which is said to have two streams of water falling into it. The first one is the elephant face with flow. of river ganga and the second one is the gomukh with the flow of river yamuna as camera was not allowed inside the sanctum i'll take you around the temple and talk about my inner experience the main temple was very powerful in its presence and energy i got the opportunity to meditate inside the temple for around 15 minutes i could distinctly feel sensations on some very specific spots in my body next to the main temple is the ardhanareshwar temple the experience was very intense yet different from the main temple around 6:10 aarti at the main temple started being at the temple while the aarti was on was an unbelievably powerful inner experience try to be with the aarti This divine day which I will never forget in my life ended with this mesmerizing aarti. Next day morning, Isha meditators had to reach the temple before 5 a.m. for a meditative process. The Gupta Kashi temple is a very important place for all the people associated with Isha because Sadguru Shri Brahma had once spent 3 months in this temple with few of his disciples this reason makes gupta kashi much more special and important for me and all the isha meditators after the meditative process at the gupta kashi temple we all left towards uttarkashi the last leg of our journey
Thank you for watching. We'll meet in the next and the last episode of this journey called the Mystical Himalayas. Namaskar.